get this party started. Let's do some fun. I know. <laughs> All right. What are we looking at? Dun dun dun. You're looking at me cutting open a box. Alright. So, first thing. Uh, we got the egg crate packaging. First thing is really bad mouse. My leap pad mouse. <laughs> and uh, power cord and. <laughs> Wait, did you say leap pad? No, I said really bad mouse. Well, I thought you said leap pad. I was no. like, as in that. Gaming is the is thing for game? kids. No. Daphne, you just come watching us do stuff. Okay. Ooh, and then here's the piece de resistance. Wait, not de resistance. Piece de resistance. Whatever, whatever French term. Whatever French term. We're not French. We're Texans. Honestly, it doesn't look like it's damaged. It looks. Uh, I'm gonna inspect the whole thing before we get going here, but... Just to make sure... No kick on the front. It's good. I particularly saw a little bit of kick on the box in the back here. But it doesn't look like there's even a dent on the thing. Yeah, the packaging held it. It's yeah, it doing did. just fine. Huh. Well, uh, that's gonna be fun. Oh. What? Oh, I'm just looking at the connections, you see? Uh, we've got... Two display port and one HDMI. What does that mean? Uh, in short, what that means is um, basically display port's the new stuff to HDMI. This thing. Yeah. Uh, it's the new. It's basically the new upgraded version of HDMI. So will I be able to use my current monitors? Um. Nope. Oh no. Instead of this, you need. To display port. Yeah, this is. I could only run one. One monitor. Make sure I'm plugging this in right. There. Oh great! I figured there'd be some problem since I'm running an older system. Running. I don't know what that is. All right. Well. All right. We have the power. And we have a monitor. Wait, did you actually disconnect the PC from this back here? What? Did you disconnect the old one, like the actual power cord from it? No, I just I just pulled the power cord from it and then plugged it in here. Oh, well, here's okay. the old the old one. Let's get the mouse and keyboard. On. The uh. What is this? Uh, this and is here's the new. new. Yeah, the very nice new. Um, new. Where are the streaming? mouse cables? I know there's two. I'm gonna assume this is most cable. This is a PS3, because why not? Oh, that's what, oh, it's new to old Corsair colors. Okay, that's why I was looking at it differently. Okay. Nice and bright. Ooh, green. I love that. You know I love the, the lighting and everything. Okay, um, how does this attach so that later? Ooh. Just a Phillips head screwdriver, really? One? Only one? There's only one to hold the side, the hold the side panel on. That's, that's actually, it's actually, the way they designed it is pretty ingenious. That is actually genius. Wait, it's starting up. Oh wait, did you actually plug it up? Yeah, it's all plugged in now. Even the, oh, Monitor, baby, keyboard. it's on. Keyboard God, I forgot off. how good the lights and everything looked whenever it came on. Now it's loading some form of Windows. I think this is 10. If it starts lighting up random colors, then it's probably 10. Ah. Nope, Windows 11. 11? Is that bad? Windows 11's okay. It's, it's, they're both the same. Anyway, you got your setups. I'm gonna go throw this away. Alrighty. Uh, the camera is now no longer gonna be on the system because I'm not going to let that just, you know, be impeded. Hello. Alright. I don't want to show anything like this. All initial setup. In the keyboard layout or input method. Uh, it is U.S. right? Yeah. The key, what? the keyboard layout. Yes, it's U.S. What is all this other uh, junk? It's keyboard layouts for different regions. Why would there be so many? Uh, I don't know. I don't design. <laughs> Want to add that. a second keyboard layout? No. I can't answer this. <laughs> all right. Let's do two. 
many um, times. So I'm going to disconnect hard drives here. I'll be right back. Okay, hard drives are disconnected. Honestly, I think the only thing salvable out of this whole thing is power supply, RAM sticks, <laughs> and that's it. <laughs> yeah, you just realized how broken that thing is? Yeah. Or realized... What'd you just pull from it? Hard drives. Oh, the hard drives are salvageable? Yeah. Cool. Don't. <laughs> I spent $70 for this. Oh! <laughs> also, speaking of, where's the cool new thing connected? The new thing? This? Oh. Yes. Unbox. Hold up, yes. guys. Here's the beautiful thing. Your disk drive. I now have a disk drive since this thing is so sleek that it doesn't even need one. Actually, it does for what I'm going to be using it for. I suck at using keys <laughs> to cut open stuff. So I might actually download a lot of my music from my CDs onto... Well, I guess before we even try that, uh, I would suggest running a test run because some of them don't do that. So we're going to run this and make sure that it works properly. Yeah, good point. Let's put that back in my DVD writer. Alakazam, Alakazoo. You know what I have to say? Actually, I'm not going to flick you off on no. camera. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, oh wait, I'm, I skipped finger. You skipped something. I skipped finger. There's probably, what is this? I don't want to know what that is. What Checking is for, oh my god, please no. Please, have, hopefully it has most, if not all the updates on it. I hope it has most, and it just has like the cube, and it just has like That's the, a very sleek design like for updates. a... Because here's the disk drive itself. That's actually a very sleek design for the disk drive. Hang on, hang on, ASMR moment, if I can pull it. ASMR. That's satisfying. That is actually one of the most satisfying sounds. Again, ASMR moment. We got more. If Hold we can up. find the end of it, where is it? There it is. Just a light. That's one end. One end. Yeah, I suck at opening. I suck at pulling this stuff because I have short nails and I keep chewing on them. Habits. Welcome to habits. Um, okay, we're pulling it from this end. Honestly, it's right now. Your computer's a lot quieter than mine. <laughs> you don't hear. Yeah, honestly, I hear no noise coming from it. Yeah, and it, look it's how not much, running a fan at 20 miles an hour. <laughs> look how much smaller this is, like hand comparison to. This big chunky whatever this is. Chungus. It is this is a chungus computer. I even Seven had just there. the dopey Perfect, that's its new location for now. Yeah, and then I have a nice No, I had to have it because nice uh, glowing controller. Here, let's get this in. Right now while we wait. Let's go ahead and get the beauty. I even love like how it has all this green. I will say it's also light. Yeah, it's honestly one of the lightest PCs I've ever seen. Honestly, I think I've got a good deal on a good PC. Glowing. I got a good deal on a good PC, though. Yeah. Just exactly what I wanted. Oh, also, turning up the sensitivity on these mouses. That is really simple. I like that. I love the concept honestly, of it. Honestly, I'm jealous, because of mine, you have to press the button like nine or ten times. Mine, it's just... Boop. Yours, you just press it once and it boop, goes. Boop, 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 boop. I keep it on green though. And I also love how it has customizable buttons on the side. I can use just the trigger. One. It only has one, it's that, it's the fire 
the target fire button, button tar yeah. targeting button. Honestly, that'd be good for like war, uh, war machines and stuff like that. Yeah. Which is actually a game that I'm kind of interested in playing. <laughs> just the the, the, the the pop. Honestly, just a separate disk drive compared to this actually having the built-in dongle or don't. The buttons won't work, so you gotta kind of force it. Cause yeah, there you go. Power. You don't have power. No power, that means you have to kind of force. Okay, wait. I'm just gonna not have the camera facing that. Hello. Last update, June 2021. <laughs> what? What? Oh my god, that's a long time. I've I've read the whole thing. There's like nothing to it. Uh, except now it's time to try to remember my Microsoft account. I leave you. <laughs> leave me. To I can't that. answer for that. <laughs> you can't because you weren't there when I made it. And I also and it's not my account, so I'm not gonna remember anyway. But yeah, my Epic game account. My Epic. Can you speak games English? Account. Yes, I can mm -hmm. English. But, um, my Epic Summer. Games account got hacked, and at this point, I'm not going to use their service anymore. Because of how the recovery system works. It's, yeah. The first one is inherently flawed. They kind of screwed you over on that recovery. The, the first method of recovery is inherently flawed because it requires you to maintain the first email to the account. That one is inherently flawed because not everyone maintains their emails. Sometimes emails shut down. Sometimes they can't pay for the service. So, therefore, the, e the system there is inherently flawed. The second one is outright dangerous because you have to give your IP out. Which? To a company that you do not know and do not trust. Because I guess what? I do not trust Epic... a single person with my IP. Yeah, because Epic Games has been known to have some issues with that stuff. Yeah. With stuff getting out. And I'd rather not have... My information just floating around on the web. Yeah. Don't ever trust any site or anything like that that asks for IP. Heck, or even just a site that you know is inherently sketchy because it's going to hack you regardless. Yeah. VPN. And VPNs still don't help because sometimes that said VPN you might be using, even if it's a free one, the free one might also be the one that's screwing you. Yeah, um, I end up using NordVPN because I have a uh, subscription with it. Yeah, I know some things are automatically have stuff like that installed. NordVPN was installed on my computer automatically. I, I want to get a uh, Surfshark. That's a good one. I've seen a lot of gamers have it, and it's honestly really good because it's meant for like international travel. Wow, this computer, this is not, this keyboard's actually not too. Terribly bad in, compar a, in comparison to the a, other keyboards I've seen. This one's not bad for a like if you just bought this PC and you didn't have the money for like Anything keyboards else, and stuff. You yeah, just had a, you just bare had bones. A and a computer. You're just going bare bones, but I mean, it's a little mushy. It's a little mushy. Yeah, you you can feel it in the keys. It's a little mushy. Ew, yeah. that's a weird feel. I don't like that. That's um, that's the membrane membrane system. I you don't have, like you have mechanical and, and membrane. This is this is mechanical, which is very loud, but very loud but very nice. This and is very membrane. reliable. And these are yeah, yeah. They also don't work La as reliably, and they don't last as long because more no, keystrokes can be done on these. They they last longer. It's just that they're not as reliable because they have a tendency to what is what is do what is called ghost keying. Which means you hit the key, and then it keys again, even though you only hit it once. Oh. Yeah. All right. Wait. What? Who's, you, who's oh. using this? Device? I need you. This is your setup. I could either use my actual name. Those keys are. Right. Or I could always it's just nice use time. my YouTube. I think I'm going with my YouTube. Which, by the way, I changed my YouTube back to what it used to be. Libby. The Beast. Lick Beast YT. Lick Beast. Alright, um... Make sure you pick something you'll absolutely remember. Well, let's go ahead and have something that Take I will away. never forget. But yeah, I plan on 
doing full kit with uh, with airsoft. <laughs> going to that surplus store, we're gonna have a blast. Uh, I'm literally gonna buy a. I, I'm not kidding when I say I'm gonna buy that. Uh, the when I buy the um, Chris Vector, I'm gonna buy that in like 30 magazines. <laughs> I'm gonna be loaded because it. Because what it is, is the main reason I'm... Oh no, do you want to go like full tactical with the gear? Yes. Uh, they have everything from tactical flashlights. Heck, uh... The only thing I'm going to really want is a tactical flashlight and a laser. I'm not going to run any sights on it. I'm not going to run anything like that. Because I'm not going to... Oh, I can get a hold of one of those... Remember the original army flashlights? The big, bulky Vietnam ones? Yeah, that I'm they've not going to used those. since Vietnam? I'm going to do the one... I'm going to do the one that attaches to said fire... Something easy that I will obviously remember because it's from an old children's show. Because that's what I named my pet. Ha! Huh, this one's easy. Security question three. I've hated security questions since I was very young. They haven't worked. Huh? They haven't worked, ever. Yeah, never. I don't know why they exist. They ask for them, but they never actually work. I feel like they're just trying to get data from you, honestly. Yeah. That's honestly probably the reason why they do it, is just to get data. I could always just give them very, very wrong info. I give them vague answers. Uh, your mom's house. <laughs> what was the name of your dog? Your mom. Where were your parents? No, I actually, on that one, I give them the real answer. I literally give them the answer of peanut butter. Yeah, we had a dog named Peanut Butter. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously? Yes. Okay, well, actually, no, correction. It wasn't a dog. It was a cat. It was a cat named Peanut Butter that got run over by my grandma. <laughs> <laughs> so what was the weirdest pet name that you... That your Kai? Kai? So we had a name... So, um, this was before I was born for, um, Kai... He was also another one that my grandmother ran over. How did you? How many talk animals? In his because she accidentally over? forgets to shut the door, and they're not. Uh -oh. They're not outdoor. They're not outdoor cats. They're indoor cats. So they get outside, and they don't know peanut butter was a lazy piece of crap. He literally just laid there and let himself get run over. Kai actually ran into the tire. Oof! Thinking it was something to attack. Yeah, that sucks. But um. The interesting story with um, Kai, how he was named, is my dad found him. He was a street cat. Uh, he found him at the side of on the side of the road, like drenching in sweat and breathing heavily Heavily. like a dog um, on the road, and wasn't moving. So he got he got some water from his truck and got some quick food from a local store and took him home. And he took care of him. He got all the stuff for it. He got all the, um... Hold up. He got... Can't tell. He went to... God dang it, it broke. <laughs> he got, uh... God, I tried to angle the camera on this. I tried to do it. But he got all of the, um, stuff for it. He literally went and went to Walmart that, that afternoon, bought some food for it, bought a bowl, bought water, bought all this stuff for it, and went and got him the... T got the cat the shots... And the way he named it was actually kind of interesting because he found it near. Let's his, go. He found it near his sorority group, Kai Fi. Kai Fi. Yeah, that was the name of uh, his sorority group. Was Kai Fi. I really question. You know, I've they, honestly Kai is a great name. <laughs> great name for a pet. What about Fi? No. <laughs> Literally, that's his first and middle name, Kai Fi. I don't mean to offend <laughs> any. I don't ever mean to offend anyone that is a frat boy or a sorority girl. But seriously, I had to go with the Latin, the Latin language for yeah. naming. Like, I'm sure most of them don't even know what their name even stands for half the time. Yeah, my dad actually knew the name of it. I know what the name is, and I don't care to say what it is. <laughs> I mean, I also, I love that this one actually has the new can, lightning. I think you can change This it. one has a lightning charger. 
It has a, a port. A uh, USB-C, yeah. yeah um, I think you can change the color. I wonder how. Let me do some Googles. I'm actually curious. Uh, HP Pavilion, how to change color. Yeah, because that's actually HP really Pavilion, cool. HP Pavilion, how to change color. Oh, they don't. So they're green. Uh, it's fine. LED. Oh, that's it's fine. fine. We can change it later. It's fine. We can throw some <laughs> RGBs in there. We can put some RGB in it. It'll be fine. <sighs> this is a beautiful piece of tech, and I love it. It looks so sleek. Yeah. It, it honestly has a very ergonomic and beautiful design, and yeah. it's lightweight. It's that thing's, good quality. That thing's freaking light. That I mean, sucker right there has got some heft. That's got some weight to it. That one you can chuck across the yard and it'll be fine. <laughs> you could literally play baseball with that. Yeah. But, no, I would not recommend. We're not doing that. <laughs> no. Until this thing dies, we're not doing that. I mean, we'll play, we'll play some baseball with a uh, heat sink. Oh, God. <laughs> you know what sounds like a very fun game? In they should have, like, uh, Madden and stuff like that in VR. They do. No, they should. No, they do. They do? Yeah. What? The only thing is, it's on the, it's on the Oculus Store, but there is a, it is there. It is an option. I wonder there. how it plays. Yeah, not great. Not terrible. Not terrible? So I'm guessing you it's play a, as the it's a PC VR. It's a PC VR experience that you are forced to get the Oculus Store on your computer, but it's a decent game. Hmm. It's a decent game. It's kind of fun. It's free. Honestly, I'm now actually... Or at least I got it for free. I'm tempted to try and actually run <coughs> a game a game on here once I get it actually up and running. Should be quick. Yeah, honestly, with an on it from the dad's so much fun. I'm gonna build it's, I'm gonna build the worst ships with you. <laughs> honestly, because I'm most likely the type who's gonna build something that is so I'm gonna make it run, you're gonna be the guy that builds the frame. <laughs> <laughs> you're gonna build the you're gonna build the whole frame of the of the boat, and I'm gonna be the one that makes it work. <laughs> you know I'm gonna build something that's outrageous and shouldn't exist, but yes. somehow exists. Yes, no, I know you okay. are. I was, I've been wanting to play a what one game we should really run is World of Tanks. That'll run perfect on there because it's actually super light. You know what? We're running Panzers, buddy. <laughs> Uh, no, we're running T-34s, what are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna run the T-34. We're going all out. Oh my god, we're gonna go all out. God. I really do love watching gameplay for World of Tanks. It looks like a really fun game, honestly. It is. And it's, it's better with other people. Yeah, it's it kind of boring Plenty. on your own. Is there a campaign? No. Oh, it's just straight multiplayer, but it's super fun. I could always play Battlefield. We could always play War Thunder. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I'm gonna. I'm literally gonna get flight controllers on it. You know I have flight controllers. <laughs> I know, I'm gonna, gonna set the whole thing up. You're gonna run flight controls. Me, I'm just gonna be. Running I'm gonna be the pilot. The <laughs> I'm just gonna be your gunner in the back. Like, I'm gonna be the pilot. I mean, no, you can't have a gunner. You're, we're all in separate planes. Oh man, yeah, that'd be really cool though if we could run like a team sort of thing like that. Just honestly, that would be awesome. We just have. We literally just have a plane duel. Yeah. Ooh. We just have a dogfight with like four people, but except. There's four planes. You know what would be so nice? There's four planes and 16 players. Playing that game. That would be fun. In VR, but not using your VR controllers, but actually using the flight controllers. The flight I controls. Have. But you could still see around the cockpit and play the whole game like that. God. That's an epic idea, huh? Yes, and I've done it before. Here's the thing I've done it before. I, I wonder how we set up the flight controllers. I wonder how a mech game would play like that. I haven't tried that yet, but that is a thought. I just gave you a good thought. That is huh? a thought. I just gave you a good thought. Yes. I really haven't tried that yet, but that is a great thought. I was like, huh, well, he's play he has flight controllers and we play... And I have VR. And you have VR. Let's throw those together and play a game where you control a mech. That would be awesome. I would love to just see, and you just see like 50 guys over there, and you're just like, cool. Boom. <laughs> God, the stuff we're gonna get up to. This is gonna be dumb. <laughs> it's gonna be dumb, but it's gonna be great. There's nothing better than gaming online with your friends. Cause like, we're sure, gonna, I love hanging out with my stuff. In. I love hanging out with my friends, but sometimes we both have busy schedules, and if, you know, we both have things at home, but we have free time and later on. We can always just hop on our game and just run games together. <laughs> Currently, at the moment, after school every day, I'm on, I'm online. 
Yeah. At this point, yeah. I've given up on Epic Games. I'm not. I'm not yeah, even gonna try and attempt to redo it, even though there's three hundred dollars on the account worth of games. I'm not gonna try it. Mm. True. I, I'm. I'm done with the. I'm done with the setup. I'm not gonna do it. Yeah. I'm probably gonna run Steam, and I'm gonna try and. I would say only do Epic Games if you're gonna go for the free stuff on there, because they yeah. give out. They give out at least one free game a week. Which will be nice. Yeah. Because honestly, and... as a budget gamer who's trying not, I. This was probably my Literally, audience. Borderlands 3 at the moment is free. It's free. Yes. Free? free. 3 is free. Free? Yeah. <laughs> Borderlands 3 is currently free on the market right now. Anyways, it's currently doing your set dun, 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 Let's go! <laughs> <laughs> we both, our brains are like... Yeah, we're doing this. <laughs> this might take a few minutes. Alright, well, enough with the documentation. Because this is about to get more private and trying to get this thing set up. So, gonna have to uh, 